Hello guys, Elias here. Um, today I have uh, a new unboxing and uh, overview for you. It's the AX860 Platinum uh, Plus Power Supply from Corsair. This is the AX860 which corresponds to 860 watts. Uh, it comes in a nice uh, bag uh, as usual from Corsair. This particular model has um, another version which has a little I here, uh, which stands for um, intelligent, uh, which, uh, and it comes with Corsair Link uh, plugin. Uh, it's a it's a hardware a USB plugin that you attach to your motherboard, and Corsair Link software, which you can use to uh, configure and monitor your power supply. But this particular one does not come with uh, that option. Uh, the reason I uh, decided to get this one is because I had a bad experience with 1200 AX 1200i power supply, which uh, was malfunctioning and had to be replaced. Was running hot. The, the fan was not turning properly. Anyway, uh, this one uh, is a platinum 80 pl plus platinum power supply, which means that it can run up to 92% uh, efficiency. And uh, if you live in a region where electricity is very expensive, like uh, I do, uh, you would care uh, for the electricity bills, and you would pay a little more for to get a better power supply, higher efficiency power supply to lower your bills. Especially if you run your computer uh, for five, eight, ten hours a day. Maybe some of you running uh, non-stop. So in that case, it would be a better idea for your components and for your electricity bill to get a higher efficiency power supply and um, uh, lower the bills. Uh, it has two options, uh, one uh, hybrid and one normal mode. In hybrid mode, the, the fan will not turn, will not spin, as it also said on this uh, sticker as well. It says silent operation at low to moderate loads. In this mode, the fan will not spin. So you shouldn't worry if it doesn't spin, it doesn't mean that it's broken, but it means that it's uh, running in hybrid mode and is more efficient and uh, uh, the passive cooling is sufficient enough uh, not for the fan not to turn. Uh, here you can see all the modular co connections here. We have 124 pin, uh, then we have peripherals, peripherals uh, SATA and Molex. This, this is the 24 pin and the second part of it. Then we have four uh, plus four CPU, another one for four, uh, plus four CPU, and then we have uh, the PCI Express uh, connections. So let's see the cables as well, what we have here. We have uh, two dual uh, six plus two uh, PCI Express cables and two uh, single six plus two cables which means that you can uh, run effectively up to three uh, triple SLI or triple uh, crossfire setup, uh, triple cards, or quad SLI uh, and quad crossfire if you, if you have dual uh, GPU cards. Then you have two CPU cables. CPU, if you have a motherboard running a dual CPU setup, then you can power it with uh, up to two provided cables, 24 pin uh, motherboard cable. Then you have two Molex for uh, ports, which means that you have eight Molex uh, connectors. And you have three uh, by four um, SATA cables, so effectively 12 SATA devices. And you have two floppy connectors or uh, whatever uh, other device you have that runs uh, from this uh, power outlet. Some zip ties, uh, Corsair sticker and some uh, screws to attach your power supply to your case and the power cable along with uh, AX series manual and the warranty card. The cables come in this nice bag so you can save those that you do not require at that particular moment, nice and easy to store. And as I said, uh, this power supply is rated at 860 watts, uh, 
uh, continuous power. Uh, this is the main difference of good power supplies, especially platinum or gold uh, rated power supplies from the lower end cheaper power supplies that uh, claim that to provide a similar amount of power. Uh, and this power supply can provide continuous power at that, at that rate and also uh, more stable power uh, to your components than uh, cheaper grade uh, power supplies. Plus, uh, the AX series power supplies from Corsair have a uh, 7 years warranty, which means that um, most probably is going to have you covered um, for the whole lifespan of your computer, maybe more because um, usually people uh, change the hardware from three to five, six years, not more. Uh, so I think uh, this pretty much covers uh, all of it. If you have any experience with uh, this power supply or the other AX series power supplies, please share your thought, thoughts with me. Uh, let me know in, down in the comment section. Subscribe for more videos, uh, like this video if you liked it, uh, send it to your friends, share it with them if you think uh, they will benefit from it. Uh, for now, thanks for watching, bye bye.